hey everyone today I have exciting video for you so one of the things I love to do is going to bin stores and thrift stores and explore through the stuff and usually I find great deals and uh, recently I've been going at least uh, once a week and my favorite day in the bin store is the one dollar day and every time I go I buy more than 10 items so I thought uh, every week I will choose 10 items to show you and explain why I got them and usually I get these items for a few reasons either I get interested in the item and I would like to keep it for myself or some of them I try to resell on marketplace or eBay and some of them I repurpose for something else or they got like parts missing or something I try to fix it so stay tuned because some of these items are unbelievable for one dollar and if you are new to the channel Make sure you subscribe and click the notification bell to get notified every time I post a video. And now let me show you those uh, 10 awesome points. Alright, so the first item is uh, this uh, pack of LR44 batteries. I found this a really good deal for $1. And I thought to myself, maybe I can use it for uh, some devices, like I have some small flashlights or measuring uh, devices for temperature and humidity and stuff they use these batteries and I also thought maybe I can sell it on marketplace or eBay and then after when I got uh, home I checked the price and I found it on Amazon uh, for around $12 so that was really interesting up next is this uh, electric sprayer It works on batteries. You open these two screws and there are four AA batteries here. And you extend this one. You connect this one to a bottle. And then you can spray the liquid using this one. I searched for it and I figured that it comes with the a certain uh, liquid for plants to spray plants and stuff but I would use it in a different way I would just find a bottle that this cap would fit on and then I can, I can just add whatever liquid I need to spray I found it in Walmart it comes all together with the container of the liquid for about uh, $20 This one is really cool because I use uh, these utility blades. So I found these blades in this bag. They are really sharp, so I'm trying to handle them carefully. They seem really nice quality. I'm not sure how many there are here. I hope I don't cut myself. It says here five blades, but there is way more than five. So probably about ten or twelve of them. This I would just use uh, for my utility knife. I usually use this one a lot, so that was a really good deal. Next is this uh, wall outlet plug. The reason I like this one because it got these buttons and they got arrow on them. This pointing to this side and this one to the left side. So if you plug something here, you can actually turn it on and off from this button. So this is uh, really helpful sometimes if you want to plug something and you don't want it to stay on. You can just turn it off from here. These they come uh, two in one pack, but I only found one. I searched on Amazon and I couldn't uh, find the price because they are currently unavailable.
this one is one of my favorites uh, this is uh, a ceramic uh, nail filing set I use them for woodworking they are really nice if you drill a hole and then you would like to make the hole a little bit bigger or uh, smoothen uh, corners or edges that are sharp they are really useful there are six of them here uh, each three are different and I looked for them on Amazon there are 10 different sizes for $15 that's the closest I was able to find but it was a really good deal even six of them for $1 They are uh, packaged really nice. So you just uh, put them in the rotary machine and they feel nice quality, really sharp. Another one of my favorite points was this uh, light bulb. This is a three-way light bulb and it goes up to 4800 lumens. So that's really bright. The only thing with this light bulb, I wasn't able to test it because it's not a typical base you find in the house. This one is called the E39. The one you find in the house is E27. So I searched for adapter that converts E39 to E27 it was around seven dollars so I'm not gonna buy the adapter I'm just gonna wait and maybe I find it next time in the bin store I really like these uh, bulbs they are uh, useful for the house I have a collection of different ones I searched for it on uh, Amazon I couldn't uh, find the exact same one but I found similar and uh, the one I found it was around hundred eighty dollars with the same name but that they claim to be way brighter than this one so I'm not sure how much this one would be I can guess around fifty dollars maybe but that just random guess I'm not sure exactly This next one is really cool. It's these uh, LED um, bulbs. Just a really tiny LED. You can just, uh, once you pull this one and then just turn this on. It doesn't have any button or anything. I guess it's designed for just one time use until the battery is on out but uh, I can just put this paper back between the batteries to turn it off there are different colors here and the reason I got these ones because the type of the batteries inside uh, I would need those uh, batteries for certain things like uh, some kind of watches and uh, other uh, stuff and it's a really nice amount uh, there are about uh, maybe 20 of them here so each one got two batteries so that's about 40 batteries I searched for them, found them on Amazon. I think 10 of them for $8. So that was still good for $1 for this. Next is this uh, computer mouse. It's a nice one, it doesn't make loud click when you press it. It's not uh, branded or anything. Some people they look for brands but uh, for me I don't uh, 
care that much about bond as long as it's working properly especially if you are trying to resell it usually people look for bonds and what's interesting about this one so first thing I like the ones that take only double A battery because it lasts longer and also you only have to use one battery the other thing the receiver was available with the mouse usually these are missing and you have to dig in the bins and if you get lucky maybe you find them or you don't find them usually when I go to the bin stores I spend minimum two hours digging in the bins and that's why I find these deals you have to put uh, the work it seems like it's all uh, like garbage and stuff in the bins some people uh, they don't like to surf but you really have to put the work to find uh, the good deal I didn't bother uh, to search uh, about the price because these are usually around ten dollars or even cheaper maybe five dollars so I'm just gonna assume five dollars for this one but I just like these computer mouse I have a collection of them and I use it a lot that's why I took it next one is this uh, dispenser it got measuring on it I like this one because usually I use uh, rubbing alcohol to clean stuff and this one is easy you can just fill it and then you press the cover and then it dispenses a little bit of alcohol here and I can just dip a swap in it or something if I want to clean like circuit boards or tiny corners and stuff and uh, I'm not sure how much this would be I would say maybe three dollars or something like that not a big deal but I just needed one of these that's why I got this one and the last item for today's list is these uh, tire valve cap they are uh, metal ones and there is uh, 10 of them here and this was interesting to me because these metal ones they seal better on the valve in case if there is some leak or something they are more tight than the plastic ones sometime I had a problem with the tire valve that was leaking air and I tried the plastic ones they didn't seal it properly so I thought these might work better they're not opened yet just gonna open them to see the quality so it looks like inside there is a uh, plastic and then at the very bottom there is a uh, rubber ring that was here not sure if you can see it in the video This one I would give it maybe ten dollars the price for this. So that was uh, ten items. If I was to buy those uh, items at a regular price, it would be uh, over hundred dollars for sure. And it was only one dollar, so why not? I also like to keep some stuff as backup in case if I need it suddenly so I don't have to buy it at regular price so yeah let me know which of these items you like the most or what would you do with it if you would buy it at regular price let me know in the comments and if you enjoy this kind of videos then make sure you subscribe to the channel to see all the next videos that I post because I will be posting video every week at least because I'm gonna go to those uh, bin stores and dig through the bins and uh, for sure I will find some deals 
usually I find more than 10 items but I will take 10 items to show you guys and I will see you in the next video